Hello, it's me again. I just wanted to do a quick tutorial real quick on um, the little uh, fan that I had made for my sister's jumbo tag. Um, somebody made a comment the other day and I've been wanting to do a tutorial and I kind of forgot about it. So they made a comment and I guess I remembered I wanted to do a tutorial but they're made out of a uh, little cupcake, um, cupcake cups. So this is the uh, the one that I, well, looks like the one I made for my sister. And uh, you just put it in your mini albums, anywhere, um, cards, card making, anything. And uh, I think they're really simple, really cute. So that's like the one. I hope the lighting's good because um, right here in front of the window. But this is one, and then I make this one too. This is a burgundy color one, and they're so simple, so cute to make, and like I said, you can use them in any any project. They're very simple. I'm going to show you how I did it. I'll just put those there, and all you need is little um, cupcake cups. So I'm using these, um, and then I got these little baby ones. I got these little pink ones, a little decoration there. And these little gold colors, little decoration, brownish gold, oh, I'm not sure. Anyway, these are like beige ones. They're like wax paper. The only thing that I didn't like about these, it's because it's like wax paper, so my hot glue gun, it doesn't stick. It comes off. So I had to use um, my uh, tacky glue. So anyways, all you do is you just fold it in half. And then you get uh, the ribbon of your choice, or trim. I'm going to use this one here. And I guess I'll use this end. And all you do is, um, make sure I have it the right way, this way. And uh, all you do is you grab your glue, open your, after you fold your little cup, you open it up, and you just put glue all around it from one side. It's better to do one side at a time. So, like that. Just on the side. So then what you do is you grab your trim that you're going to use and you're just going to put it there on the edge with the glue. The only thing, because it's like wax paper, this cup thing that I'm using, it's it takes a little bit to dry. So, I'm going to have to find some other ones that are not um, wax so that I can use my glue gun. I think with the glue gun it would be so much easier and faster. But anyways, I think the cut should be here. You just cut the excess off and, I mean, it still works good. It's just, you know, a little lower because you gotta wait for that to dry. So once you have it like that, then you can go in and glue this side now. So get your glue and go all around again. And I kind of put a little bit in the center just to seal it shut. press down and just line it up at the edges and there you have it now for me to give it more for me to give it more of a decoration that's when I went and added another piece of uh, take that off another piece of uh, I'm going to use this one another piece of uh, or another cupcake cup these are a little bit smaller, so I can give it a little border. See? So, on this one, I'm going to open it up and put glue all around. And then I'm going to put some in the center, too. So 
So then you just line it up in the center. This part you just choose whatever center you use. I'm gonna dig in my little paper flowers here. See if I can find a little one that'll fit. Just a small. Kind of like that one. And this one doesn't have any pearl in the center. I like the one with the pearl. I don't want to go and dig and see what else I could put, so I'm just going to put one of those for now. And um, all you do is glue it. I'm probably going to cut me a little bow. Give it a bow here. And let me see if I have any right here. Oh, there it is. This is kind of a beige color. Cut me a piece. I'm going to stick it on there. And all you do is make yourself a little bow. Grab my glue and put it just right on the center. Put my little bow there. I'm going to grab my flower. I made these little flowers out of, uh, I don't know what kind of paper is that, but I went to my local thrift store and I like the paper. It's very nice to make flowers. I don't know what kind of paper it is though. I've never seen it before, but it works awesome for flowers. And I'm just going to pop that right there. And there you have it. Another little fan. Oh, so cute. And that's my project. Well, thank you so much for watching. Please leave me a comment and let me know what you guys think. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.